two, one, go. Okay, today I'm going to demonstrate my latest invention for my ice castle fish house. As you can see, we've got two beds and the high wheel wells, and usually we need to sleep more than two people. So this is my invention. All you do is reach in here, get out your legs, attach them here, tighten your thumb screw, same on the other side, tighten the thumb screw, and release the Velcro on the sides. It's the only reason that's there is to keep it from rattling when you when you drive. And then this main bolt that holds it up. Drop your bunk into place. And now put the plywood on. The reason that I use plywood instead of a mesh is so when the frame is up, we can still see out the window and we don't and we have all these things that we didn't have to move or anything. That's why that's why I use the open design. Okay, so set your bunk down, put in your piece of plywood for your base, slide down your mattress, and now you've got a nice comfortable bunk to sleep on. The mattress is from a hospital bed, and to get on all you need is a bucket or anything so you can just get one step up and uh, get on your bunk. The other issue we had in this fish house was we never had a good way to get to the second bunk, but now the height of this bunk makes it pretty easy to crawl from one to the other, as you can see. And getting down is easy too. So that's it. That's uh, our solution for a bunk bed in the Ice Cashel fish house with the high wheel wells. And we're probably going to put one on the other side too which still allows room to walk through. The other advantage is with a cot you can't fish but with these bunks you can fish all your holes. That's it. Thanks.